Hi, Michelle. Hi, hi, Maisha. How are you? Hello. Pleasure. Nice to you. To, you too. Uh, pleasure to meet you and congrats on season three of Truth Be Told. Um, I was really thrilled to see that you focused on the subject of missing black girls and women. Super excited. Loved the entire um, season. Um, Michelle, can you uh, kind of explain um, how that became a, a theme? Well, uh, during production of season one, we got a call from the Bay Area where my husband and I are from that something very similar to this had happened to extended family. And it was devastating, it continues to be, and the show provided a perfect opportunity because we're set in the Bay Area with an Oakland family and we started to plant the seeds in season two to tell this story because it's just so important and so significant and the Bay Area is a hotbed for this kind of activity. Yeah, and with the fascination with true crime mm -hmm. and the fascination with the show, because yeah. it's incredible, um, do you hope that this resonates off screen, that uh, the public takes an interest in this subject? I really do, because I think the most important thing and what Maisha and the writers were able to accomplish is that happen this happening to unexpected girls. I think that that's what we want the audience to not feel comfortable that, oh, this couldn't happen in my house. This can happen in my family because, you know, like what happened with ours, it was two family home, everything great, and then all of a sudden it wasn't. Mm -hmm. And you didn't see it coming. Yes, a uh, very important topic. Yeah. And Maisha, uh, can you talk to me about Poppy's journey, um, not just with the new set of crimes that she's dealing with, but also uh, the journey with her family, and not to give away anything. <laughs> right, yeah, that's hard with no spoilers, but she really is, at once coming into her own and at the same time trying to figure out who that is. Mm -hmm. So um, this season, we take that a step further because she makes a discovery that um, hopefully will shine some light on who she is. Um, but I also feel like we've been building, you know, her relationship with her father. They did it beautifully in seasons one and two. And I feel like there are some great scenes this season between um, her and Shreve that just um, that just really sing and 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 help us understand who she is and who the Scovilles are. Yes, and how has it been? You have two powerhouses, Octavia and Gabrielle Union, working together. It's fantastic. It's like an explosion on the screen. Yeah, they are amazing. They are amazing. Yeah, they have wonderful chemistry, and it was just watching the relationship grow and watching the trust between the two of them over uh, ten episodes. It's really great. And how has it been collaborating the two of you? On the project, fantastic! Maisha yeah, it's been is seamless. The superstar. I've been trying to steal her on staff for two years, <laughs> and then we got her to come run the show season three. So it's been fantastic. Wonderful. Well, thank you both so much, and wishing you nothing but success. Thank, thank you. you.